Hello and welcome to the first video that I'm re releasing to the members only. Um, thank you very much for everyone for joining and becoming a member. I do appreciate it. Um, thank you for your support and helping uh, cover the costs of the channel and stuff. I do uh, very much appreciate uh, very much appreciate it. And uh, this is one of the things I am doing to try to offer value for those membership. So every time someone signs up for a membership, y'all are making me work harder. <laughs> All right, so I've rambled on for long enough. Let's get into these coins here. Intro, take 473. Cue music. Cue coins. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Now pick them up. I'm not rich. So what I am expecting is the last time I opened up some dollar coins from the coin shop, they were some pretty nice, uh, had some pretty nice uncirculated coins in there. So I'm hoping to see some of the same, um, although that's not a guarantee. And I would expect similar for the half dollars. I'm going to start out with the half dollars. And we will go from there. Let me just move these over. Uh, what I'll do is I'll crack, I'll pull these out of the wrappers and we'll take a look at the edges for any possible silver and then I'll stack them up, I'll get them all sorted. We'll check for any areas of varieties, look for any NIFCs, which it wouldn't surprise me if they did send NIFCs to the bank just because, you know, you, after a certain amount of NIFCs, you just, you're just stacking more and more coins and uh, you can't always hold on to everything. Um, I know I don't have enough money to hold on everything I find, so <laughs> I can understand at some point a coin shop running out of room there. So let's start cracking. And uh, sorry for the length of the video at the start, at the start of this video, but I just wanted to be in the first there's only video. I just wanted to make sure I'll you know, go over a couple things there. And starting out, 2008 Philadelphia, that is an NIFC. So that is some of what I am expecting here. Let's see, can I just flip it down on that side? Yep. And all edges are clad. They do look kind of nice. So let's just take a peek. 2007, 2003. This looks like a nice roll of NIFCs. Cool. Let's stack that up over here. Next roll. Let's see what's in here. It's like a half. <laughs> the reverse side of a Kennedy. And the other side of a Kennedy. This is a 1993. All right, so I see some of these that are pretty circulated. Um, you know, this looks like 90s, 80s. There's a 70 in there. But again, all clad. So that looks like just a standard circulated roll. And uh, as I sort through them and, and stuff, we'll sort through them and see what we got. 90s, 7, and another reverse. And again, all clad. Do have some nice, that's a nice 77 there. It's a pretty nice 73. There's a really nice 77 out of Denver there. So we do have some nice stuff in there. So let's just keep stacking those up out of the way. Let's crack the next wall and see what's in here. Ooh, that is a pretty nice and shiny 84 there. Might be a slightly circulated, but it is pretty nice. Um, either it's just weakly struck or it has some slight wear on it. There's an 87 out of Denver. 87, that's the NIFC, right? 87 Philly and Denver, those are NIFCs. Cool. 
Let me just double check. I'll double check that and just make sure I'm saying that right. I don't hunt many halves because I can't really get halves from my bank. So yeah, there's some nice coins in there. So I can't, don't really hunt halves and I should have put on my half, my uh, mat that has it listed, but I don't have it out here. It really needs to be washed and I think I have it up in the laundry room to be washed. <laughs> it is really, really dirty. Last roll, looks like we got some pretty nice edges there. Probably some more uncirculated stuff. Yeah, oh, that's a really nice 96, 96 Philly and Denver. Nice. So, yep, it looks like we have some nice uncirculated stuff. Probably come out of albums and stuff. So let me sort through this. I'll sort it by date. We'll check out the NFCs and I'll check for any areas and varieties and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've got the the uh, half sorted by date. Um, I have every year has 71 um, through 2010. There was no 75s minted because they were minted in bicentennials and I've got those down here. I started doing dates like this but then I ran out of room so I put the early and late dates here. Um, 87s NIFCs and 2002 through 10 are NIFCs. Not a tender for circulation. Um, 87s came from the mint set. 2002 on was either mint sets or rolls, I believe. Um, possibly bags. I think they were selling bags as well, but they don't look like they came from bags. They look a little bit nicer. Um, I was second guessing myself when it was open. I know 87s are in AFCs, but when I was uh, cracking up the rolls, I started second guessing myself. And I was, thought, oh, maybe I forgot. I need to uh, double check. But yeah, I should have just went with my gut and remembered that 87s were, yeah, I'm, I'm a little forgetful at times. <laughs> so, got some cool stuff. Do have a, a Philadelphia and Denver from each year. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'll sort through these, check for any airs, varieties, or what have you. I didn't see anything major sorting through them. Um, I'll check for double dies on the 70s and, and what have you and uh, check for any... Uh, no FGs on on uh, the coins, and I will uh, set the best two, uh, Philadelphia and Denver, from each state, and I'll give you just a quick overview so you can see the nicest ones from those states. Um, so that's what I've got, and uh, yeah, let me sort through these. I don't want to make this video super, super long, but we got dollar coins to get through. So let me get through these, and um, I'll be right back. Okay, I have the best two of each date here sorted out. So let me stack those so you can see them both. We'll go through those really quickly. And here we have the best ones from the 70s. Philadelphia up top, Denver down the bottom. Um, some of these are quite nice, but I do have some pretty circulated ones in this set. 78 right there has some nice tone on it there at Philly. Here are the 80s. The 82 Philly and the 83 out of Denver are quite nice. And those are hard to get in nice shape. So that is really cool because there were no mint sets that year. Um, and then we have some different average circulations. The 87s are quite nice. The 88s have that nice tone. And then the 89 out of Denver is quite nice. Then we do have some more slightly circulated stuff there as well through the 90s. And here we have the 90s. Um, this is where they start to get even more nicer of sets. There are a handful of coins here that do need to be um, upgraded, but this is mostly a pretty nice 90s to 2000 set. 2001 through 10, these are all almost in quite nice um, MS state. There are a couple that have some scratching on it here and there, but all quite nice. Okay, so there they are all tubed up. I don't have, I didn't find any errors of varieties on any of them, um, but I did tube up the nicest two per decade, 70s, 80s, 90s, and 2000s. Um, so that's how I've got them tubed here. Um, I, I'm not currently collecting Kennedys. Um, I might one day, but I don't have an album. I don't have anything to do with these, so I don't know. Um, I don't have a collection, a click going for these so I don't know what I'm planning on doing with these if uh, anyone watching the video does want a collection 70s through uh, 71 through 2010 um, 
probably about three quarters of them or are quite nice mint state and there are some that do need to be replaced as you saw so that is these um if you want to shoot me an email if you want to pick these up off of me let me know um i'm sure we could work out something but that is those let me get these out of the way and we'll uh jump on the uh, uh, uh dollars here um I was thinking this uh, half video might be about 10, 15 minutes right now. So what I'll do is I will break up the dollar coins into a second video. So there will be two uh, members only videos for this month since I said I was going to do both of these for y'all. So that's what I'm going to do. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to clean up these and wrap up this video for now. And then we'll do the dollar coins in another video and that might come out. Uh, sometime within the next week. So do look forward to that. So you'll have uh, two videos this month um, as a thank you. Um, I had to scrounge up some rolls and I had to uh, dump out a 90% roll for this. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I, I had a hard time finding rolls, uh, tubes for these because like I said, I'm, outside of 90%, I'm not really collecting the halves right now. So that's where I am at with that. All right, well, I do hope you enjoyed the video of the halves. So again, we'll do the dollar coin shortly. Um, if you did, hit that thumbs up, helps me out. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. All right, well, thank you very much for watching, everyone. Have a great day. And I want to give a very special thank you to all the viewers who have signed up as members. Thank you very much for going above and beyond to help support the channel. I very, very much appreciate it. If anyone is interested in becoming a member, feel free to check out the link below. Again, thank you very much for your support.